Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Desk Setup for Beginners. In this video, I'll be talking about the top 5 desk accessories of 2021 to upgrade your workspace. I got these products in the last year and I can't work without them ever since. They might just look like small add-ons to your desk setup, but they will make your work process much, much smoother. If you're having problems with your gadgets or looking to level up your productivity, this video is for you. Let's begin. My first favorite is the autonomous LED lamp. Before this, I used to use the ceiling light to work. After a while, I realized its quality is not enough for working since my eyes got tired day by day and my eyesight got worse. Moreover, at night I prefer to use a lamp at my desk rather than turning on the light of the whole room in order to focus on my work. That's when I decided to get an LED desk lamp. I really loved the one I got from Autonomous. The light is very comfortable for my eyes even when I use it at the maximum level of brightness at night. It has 4 colour modes and 5 levels of brightness. You can adjust the brightness just by a touch on the dashboard. You can also adjust its height or easily move it to the area where you need light. Its design is inspired by the architect's minimal desk lamp. I love how simple and fitting it looks on my desk. Next on the list is the single monitor arm, also from Autonomous. My small laptop was getting a bit inconvenient for me to multitask, so I got myself an extra monitor to make more space to work on. I mount the monitor to the monitor arm so that it can be adjusted to any angle I need. This also frees up more space for me to put my speaker or mini potted plants or some decorations on the table. The monitor arm is made from premium aluminum alloy, so it gives my whole setup a clean and minimal look. The third one is the laptop stand. I use this laptop stand to raise it to my eye level so that I won't get neck pain from bowing my head down when working. Also, when you raise your laptop up like this, it will enhance the airflow underneath, thus preventing it from overheating. This one is the normal aluminum laptop stand that you can find on any e-commerce site. What I like about this one is you can just pull out two sides of the stand and then adjust the height simply by moving the two lifting bars to the suitable holes. The fourth one is the microfiber vegan leather desk pad. The desk pad is like a big mouse pad for you to put both your keyboard and mouse on to avoid scratching the tabletop. This leather desk pad is made from microfiber vegan leather so it feels very soft to touch and is super durable as well. I like drinking ice milk coffee when I work and with this pad I can confidently put the cup on the pad without it getting wet or waterlogged. I can easily clean the water away when I'm done. The desk pad is about 32 inches in length and nearly 16 inches in width so I can put a lot of things on it. At the end of the day I really enjoy writing my diary on the pad. The last product is the Royal Kludge RK71 Keyboard. If your job involves typing a lot, I think you will love the experience you have with the mechanical keyboard. The RK71 has a really cool design. First off, it has a 71 key layout so there's no number pad. My job is unrelated to data entry, so it looks very neat and minimal. This keyboard has RK brown switches, so it feels very tactile when you type and the sound is satisfying. It has RGB lights on both sides and a white backlight with a lot of lighting modes for you to choose from. For this keyboard, I use the keycap stock of RK71 too. Since it's white, it can get a bit dirty over time, so you need to take good care of it. Overall, I'm sure you'll get the satisfying typing experience I have with a mechanical keyboard. Hope you guys found something you need for your desk setup in this video. Let me know in the comment section if you have any other problems with your setup and I'll cover it in the next episode. If you like this video, don't hesitate to like and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.